Josh from Life Science Centre here, and I am going to show you how to see colours that aren't there. Stare at the dot at the centre of the picture on the screen. Do not look away. In a few seconds, the screen will turn white. Keep looking. What colours can you see now? Did you see the red, white and blue of the Union flag? You have just seen an after image. The back of your eye is full of cells that respond to light when it hits them, sending a signal to the brain. Each signal acts as a dot of colour that the brain can assemble into a complete image, like putting together the pixels on a screen. Keep showing that cell the same colour of light for a while and it will tire and then become unable to see that colour for a few seconds. When it then detects white light, which is made up of all the colours together, it will be unable to see the colour that it's been staring at and instead see all of the others. For instance, if you've been staring at yellow and then look at something white, you will see the colour blue. On a colour wheel like this one, the colours opposite each other are the ones that mix together to make white. And so they are the colours you'll see if you've been staring at the colour opposite. You can use a colour wheel like this to predict what colours an after image will show you. An image negative is when you take all the colours in a picture and swap them with the colour opposite them in the colour wheel, the colour you would have to mix them with to create white light. And so when you've been staring at that image that has been inverted or reversed and look at white, you should see the original colours. Here's another. Stare at the dot in the centre. You are allowed to blink, but don't look away. You can do this with any picture. Loads of freely available tools like Microsoft Paint let you invert the colours of an image. If it's a complicated image, you might need to stare at the black and white version afterwards instead of a white screen to really make out the colours. Here we go. Could you see the Life Science Centre in full colour? If not, don't worry. Just go back and pause the video over that inverted image for about 45 seconds before moving on to the one in black and white. Staring at that first image for longer can enhance the effect. If you do try this at home, remember that strong block colours give the best results. That's why flags work so well. And please do share your best inverted images with us on social media using the hashtag LifeGoesOnline.